a reading from the New Testament as translated by the Gullah of the Culture of the uh, King James Version of the Holy Bible. This is the Gullah Bible. And as usual, we pick a spot. Stay in the front like it is. Right there. Mark. Mark is cool, I suppose. Oh boy. Can't read yet. I mean, I can't read it because the Gullah Bible has those, you know, the, the Gullahs in the, the, the large font and the, the King James, you know, the Shakespearean Marlowe languages in the smaller font. Okay, where are we going to go? Mark 141, let's go to, uh, well, let's go to 48. Disciple of them been on the road against the wind, and Jesus see that they been a, uh, have had time for meek the boat so long cross that water against the wind. So late in the night, sometime after three o'clock, Jesus going out the, to them and then a walk on top the water in a meek like a plan for past disciples them by and uh, the translation of 48 and he and, and he saw them trolling in rowing for the wind was contrary unto them and about the fourth watch at the night he cometh unto them walking upon the sea and would have passed by them. Uh, oh, I got to tell you. Oh, what, what I'm doing is, uh, this is the Gullah Bible, but uh, in my maternal side, um, I have uh, I have Geechee, you know, Gullah Geechee, and the Sea Islands, you know. The, the Gullah in Georgia is called something else. Anyway, so I had this idea uh, that I need, not, I, don't, I don't need to connect, but I wanted to, um, I was trying to figure out how when the when the enslaved was freed, you know, then, you know, how did they learn uh, to literate? How did how, how did they learn to be literate quickly? Because they did. Because you know, the the, the enslaved they they were really cooking the end of the you know the nineteenth century, the beginning of the twentieth century, and so I figured I'd just try to learn the language, was to find a process what they went through, and of course you know people say well. <laughs> Look, I don't care about being embarrassed. I'm learning a new thing. So, what can I say? You know. So we do it twice. So here's the second one of uh, Mark six, uh, page one forty one, in the Gullah Bible, the Gullah New Testament, the Gullah Bible, um, and it's uh, we're doing forty eight. Disciple then been a row against wind, and Jesus see that they been a have had time for meek. The boat so long crossed the wind, crossed the water against the wind. So late in the night, sometime after three o'clock, Jesus going out to them, and then a walk on top the water, and a meek like a like a plan for past the disciples, them by. So goes the reading. From me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the trench to bed, letting you know what I only suspect.